Welcome Hello. back. <laughs> Welcome back to uh, 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 Cheeto Boy, The Adventures of Cheeto Boy 69. Yeah, well, it's been a minute. It's been a minute. For, it's been a week. We haven't played. It's been a week, yeah. I completely forgot where we at. I know we killed the tree ball sack, and that's pretty much it. That's all I know. <laughs> yeah, we got the transposing kiln and gave it to Mr. Ludlith over there. Just... Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, Let's go. Strength builds are fun. Let me take out this witch. Just strolling along, leave her alone. No, she doesn't need. Look, she's gonna hug me. I love you. Shit! Oh, see, look at that damage. It took away half her health. <laughs> see, look at those skills. Those skills. I'm such a dodge master. So my question is to you, sir. Whenever um, oops. Whenever you go to your uh, doctors. <laughs> yeah. Um, and then whenever you get like um, what do you call it? Put under. Like when you go to sleep, when they mm. put you to sleep, have you ever been in those situations? I've never done that before. You never done that before? Nope. So my question, like, what what do you think would happen if they put you under? What do you think they do before they like go into procedure of doing surgery on your mouth or something like that? Because like, whenever I got my molars removed, not molars, what do you call wisdom them? Wisdom teeth. Wisdom teeth. There you go. Whenever I got my wisdom teeth, they had to put me under. And all I remember is like the guy was like count backwards between. Uh, um, count backwards from 10 and then I started counting backwards from 10 and I only remember getting to 9 yeah but I wonder asleep. what they do right after I fall asleep you know what I wish they did what's that I wish they like messed with your body well that's what I'm thinking they do like, like they, they tickle you <laughs> like to make sure you're actually <laughs> asleep <laughs> they tickle you they like they like kind of like pinch your cheeks or like they stick their fingers up your nose oh. <laughs> they like having a grand old time in the <laughs> operating room <laughs> oh yeah, make sure you're asleep. That's what I'm imagining. I feel like they, um, I like to think after you go to sleep, mm. they like grab your little pinky toes or something like that. They take off your shoe and they just play with your toes to make sure you're asleep. And then grab a pin to <laughs> touch your feet. And then they grab a cup of tea and then just sip and wait until you wake back up just in case. So between tea time and if you don't wake up between tea time, then they start operating. Then they start operating. And you're like, oh, okay, he's asleep. Let's get on to it. Okay, but what if you're like, um, what if you wake up while they're doing that? See, that's what my that fear just, like, is. I ran out of Estes. When I would that be so scared if that flipping happened. <laughs> um, I've heard of people waking up during the surgeries. Uh, yeah, it doesn't sound fun. It does not sound fun. I wonder if all the pain will rush back if you wake up. <laughs> oh, Because, like, maybe. your body's still numb whenever you're asleep. Because whenever I got, uh, when I woke up from the whole procedure of getting my wisdom teeth, I didn't feel a single thing whenever I got back to the, my mom's office and they gave me ice cream. Like, I couldn't feel the ice cream that was running down my face. So I was wondering if, um, you'll still, like, all the pain oh, yeah, rushes back whenever you wake up in surgery. Oh, most likely. Yeah. Most likely. Do you think I'll survive that? I think so. Go for it. Okay, go for it. Here we go. go, for go. It. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, wow. I probably would have <laughs> if I had full health. That would have helped. So you have to go to Secret Path to, um... Oh, did I just... Um, I, I think you wasted mistake. something. I don't know, I mean, I didn't think anything. Uh... I think you were walking and then getting attacked. Yeah, it's all, it's all good. Look at this dude. It's all good. I just wanted to do this. Because <laughs> I want to see if I can accomplish this. Ready? Up! Oh. Nope, not anymore. Go away! You take Go off them boys. Away. They don't want you free falling. I'm gonna be free falling. They can't do anything about it. Stop! <laughs> Stop! Stop making me waste my they Estes. Keep, you know they keep cutting your parachute Dead. forward. Dead. <laughs> yes, that's exactly that guy, what they're that guy doing. fell. D did he really? Oh yeah. Did he die? I don't I know. I bet she's waiting for you down there. Nope. Actually, he's alive. I didn't get his souls. Oh, sad news. So, <laughs> oh, then can you break your fall by falling on him like that? Oh, maybe. Okay, where's he at? Down there? <laughs> no, he's well, too far down. I, I, I have to land down here. Oh! oh. Just barely. Whoa! I would watch out though. Oh, okay, he's not gonna get you. He's just like, I don't know what to do now. I, I actually made it. Wow. That's quite shocking. Um. Oh. oh, this is the way to the lady, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. That's why I want to go this way. I mean, I could have went, like, the easy way and, like, bought... The, uh, the the key to get down here, but that's not what that one thing. <laughs> that's lame. This is more interesting. Yeah, climbing up a ladder. Yeah, watching. But um, well, I would have had to do this anyway. Yeah, but in this way, I skipped a bunch of skeleton enemies and 
That's cool. Okay, let's see? I can go this way. Wait, are the ske- Oh, wait. Talk to this lady. I'm, I'm, the th I'm thinking of the skeletons that spit on the wheels. I think there are some of those over there, actually. In this area? Now I'm just gonna touch her, and then she'll disappear. Actually, she'll disappear after I'm talking to her. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so close indeed, and I'm not entirely alone. She's blind, by the way. Oh, is she? <laughs> yeah. Oh, you got a new, um, emote. And you can buy, like, um, miracles from her. Mm, she's a religious one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Isn't there a crystal beast somewhere up on an elevator? Uh, no. There's not. I don't think down here. I thought there was. There's a bunch of rats here, though. Hate, hate, hate them. No, what room am I thinking uh, <laughs> No, <laughs> leave me alone. <laughs> what room am I thinking of that had, like, a demon... Oh, like you have to go it's, down. It's, it's, it's in a minute. You'll, you'll see it. Okay. It's past um, Onion Boy. Onion Man. Wait, I was missing a couple things over here. What's over here? <laughs> um, I have no help. So, oh. oh, what are you doing here? <laughs> oh! What are you doing here? What happened? I am going to kill you. Um, one hit and I'm going to die. Yeah. Whew. Oh, wow. Wait. Okay, you need to figure out a way out. She's, She's gonna, gonna hug, hug. and then I'm gonna... Behind. Boop. Right in the butt. And then swing, swing, right swing. Mash, mash, nope. mash. Huh. Nope, nope, huh. nope. Ah, I did it. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're done. No, 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 I'm just... Oh, there's a little crystal it. thing. There's also a monster. Or a oh, it's right. just a puppy dog. I hate the dogs. Um... um <laughs> he's like, find me. Uh... Leave me alone. Run past, run past, run past. The crystal guy's gone. Yeah, yeah. They disappear. That's annoying. annoying. But I won't, I won't what this stuff is. Time charge. Stay. So is it, away. what weapon are you mainly aiming for? Oh, oh. Aww. I'm going what? strength. I did. did you duplicate? What? There was only one, wasn't there? What the hell? <laughs> what? Hello. He looks like Voldemort. But with no eyes, so he's like Voldemort, but with no eyes. <laughs> he's the orange. He's orange. He's like Voldemort's orange cousin. The reject cousin. That no one yes. Likes to reject talk about. Cousin. Oh, I'm, I missed it. Yeah. I did it. I missed it. Man, this is like the most annoying part of this map. Uh, which side is it jump, on? Jump, jump, oh, jump, jump. It's right. Okay. It's all good. Here he is again. Hello. Favorite character here. Mm. Ah, don't disappear like that. You had me down, but thanks to you. And a I've unraveled. <laughs> On some days I begin I went up the tower, so I thought. I'm not exact anyhow. Do you see that? That humongous I'm no coward and I've a steady hand, but how now? Think twice before you go down that road. The house that I hate where the Yes, I will show you that in a minute. It's wonderful. She up oh. So is he one of the uh, crystal beast type creatures or that guy? Yeah. No, no, no. He's a demon. Oh, you fight a. Ouch. You fight a couple of those in this game. Uh, oh. <laughs> what are you doing? I want to go down. Oh, that's where the crystal beast is at. Yeah, it is. Wait, so, still yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> Just waiting. waiting for the elevator. I'll let you go first. Sorry, sir. <laughs> he didn't make it. Wow, Sorry, that buddy. Sucks. Just gonna, just gonna ruin it. Okay. Now this guy's poopy hard. This, this is poopy. the guy that turns invisible. Poopy, yeah. No, he doesn't turn invisible. I thought he turned invisible. <laughs> nope. He turns into. He's a mist guy. He's an ice guy. He's a frozen dude. Mm. There he is. What's I this? He, that's where he turned invisible. Ah. Oh. Wow. You're, oh, I remember this sword. You are this a sword left is dope. testicle. You left, testy. Ugh. Yeah, you get a sword. I love Ouch. a sword. Ouch. Stop. Stop. So... Oh, and you know what? I'm not gonna fight him yet. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way. Yeah. There's a bonfire right out here. Cause I'm gonna fucking die. And you can cheese him if you want. If you want, because, like, he can't Ooh, go through this door. this is a swamp. Not the swamp. Is it the swamp? No, this is where sacrifice is. The swamp oh. is next. Where's that? Here it is. There he is. <laughs> okay, see, this is the bonfire that I was talking about that I, I can, like, rest at and then go fight that guy and then go fight the demon. It's the closest one. Huh. You, got huh. this, you got this, bud. Huh. He's not that hard. 
Oh, that guy's ignoring me. <laughs> we might be doing what you're doing. Ow. Oof. 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 Uh. So frost just only slows you. It doesn't do any like staggering damage or anything. Uh, it doesn't. It does slow. It do, it actually does do damage. Um, okay. Immediate damage when like that bar fills up. Uh huh. But. Um. But it's not like. It also time. drains. And it also makes you drain your stamina faster. Mm. Yes. You have a small stamina. Oh. Uh. Uh. Yes, I should really like level that up. Because we were having problems last game with no stamina. Uh, were we? Yeah. I don't know why I don't remember. <laughs> you got Ow. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. That looks Yo. like the dancer from the armor. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's because they're all from Irithyll. Mm. Um, Boreal Valley. Vort of Boreal Valley. So they're, they're like the of... knights for the dancer? Yes, they're oh, the okay. knights. Not for the dancer. The dancer is one of the knights. Oh. They're so... actually the knights for, um... <laughs> What's his face? Um, can I even use that weapon? Yes, I can. I don't know if I want to. Oh, so it is. This thing is stronger. Much better. Okay. <laughs> but, um... Yeah. Of, um... Aldrich. Uh-huh. Aldrich. They're the Knights of Aldrich. Okay. Who is a boss in this game. We, okay, so I found out recently, I was reading an article about, like, sperm it. donations and stuff like that. Yeah? Would you ever donate sperm? Yeah, if I got good money from it. Well, you get $100 <laughs> per, um, per load. Ha! And game over. <laughs> this is why I rested at that bonfire. <sighs> I made a lot of money from it, sure. Well, you get $100 per load. Is that like a set amount, or is it like... $100 every time you you, you, you jack it in a cup. Every time you do that, you get $100. <laughs> what if somebody does it like full-time? Like, what if they, that's just that's their job, that's what they do? That would be pretty dope, but at the same time, you gotta think, are people going to accept your semen? Because what they do is, I was reading about it, they, mm -hmm. what they do is they look at a catalog and they look at like a profile picture of you and they look mm -hmm. at your stats They're like oh he plays guitar <laughs> he plays video games he wants to be a, a psychologist of some sort and they look all that and they're like maybe my child should be like this man they're like give me that cup and inject it into me ew yeah so that's kind of gross if you think about it you get a hundred dollars per load <laughs> now if you have a lot of endurance and a lot of stamina I bet you you can do it uh, probably. I don't know. I bet you can leave with a thousand dollars each day. I thought <laughs> maybe, <laughs> yeah. Put so ten loads in a cup. I don't know if that be. I don't know if it's even possible to do it ten times a day. I don't know. You have to freaking exercise like a madman to do it. Like there's like Olympic masturbation. <laughs> <laughs> they just have them all like have all them waving and stuff like that like all these contestants and stuff like that <laughs> and then they go dang it they put down these curtains and then you just hear uh, 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 uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like it's a sporting event yeah and just like, like <gasps> I put money on number five and it's like a horse race there you go it's like a horse race and they're like jacking it they're whoever like... whoever prees last whoever comes last you win what these men do, and they, they're like, let's have a circle jerk. And what they do is they put a cookie in the middle of all of them. Okay. And they get all in a circle, and then they, like, whack it. They whack it as fast as they can. Now, whoever comes last has to eat this cookie. Oh. That's full of men semen. Oh. And some guys really enjoy that game. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just, I don't get it. I don't understand why it's a waste of semen. <laughs> waste of it's like it's you could have sold it. Like it's in, like it's uh, some court, some sort of um, unrenewable resource, Carlo. Yeah, you can't like one day you're gonna regret jer jerking that much. Yep, it's gonna hurt you. I don't. You can't run out of <laughs> semen. You can't. It's well, not... when you're an old man, you do. <laughs> it becomes powder. You have to put water in it to get it pre mixed. <laughs> Like powdered milk? Yeah. Ew. Same thing with both women with their breasts. No. It becomes powdered milk. And they have to mix it in with water. No. <laughs> they put it in formula bags. <gasps> that would be dope. Okay, hear me out. Yeah, okay. I'm listening. Women should do this. They should dry their milk. Yeah. After, like, producing it. After they're sque squeezing their titties in a cup. 
they should dry up their milk and put it on store shelves so people can buy it. But it's like powdered form, so you have to mix it up with water. There are there are like like women who like they actually do that. No, but they like they like donate their breast milk or like something they like sell it or something like but that. But they should like make it store like store brand like Karen's milk. No one wants Karen's Ew. milk. But Ew. <laughs> because I mean I don't want my daughter to be Karen. My son to be Karen's milk. And like just some lady named Karen. Yeah, and, and she just like just... squeezes her titties and she dries them out. That's. I don't like this imagery. You know, <laughs> it's not pleasant. Now we can see the ad where it has like this mat. It's like uh, the purple ads. The purple ads for the for the mattresses. Have you seen those ads? I don't think I have. Well, okay. So basically, it's like a guy in a science room, and he's like, "Purple mattresses are the best mattresses." And then like they're like, for example, and this lady has like this man drops on it, and there's a bunch of eggs on it, and none of the eggs get cracked, or something like that. So I was like, okay, maybe they should do this for women, but like from titty milk. So they have all these ladies like lined up in an assembly, but they have like the milk, <laughs> the milk things attached to their, like the cow litter things <laughs> attached to the women. Okay. And they're just producing milk <laughs> into cups. And then they're like going through an assembly line of like women's milk in cans. And then they dry out the milk and then they put it in bags. But like all on the bag, it says... Betty's milk and it has their face on it. You should like. Oh, oh this is gross. Okay, it's not. No, no, no. Okay, it's not slavery. It is. They chose will you be to pay, produce. Milk. Will you be paying them? Well, of course. <laughs> okay. But whoever lasts the longest producing milk, they get more money. That just sounds like a dairy farm for <laughs> humans, Carlo. But they're willing to be a dairy farm. It's like sperm donation, man. Come on, you can't hate on them. And they get uh, like $100 an hour. There. Every hour you producing milk, mm -hmm. you get $100. So what are you going to do? Sell it on the black market or I'm something? I'm going to sell it at Walmart. You're going to sell it. People just go to buy, buy to, go to Walmart and buy breast milk? Yeah. Well, it dried out breast milk. So you just have to add water. <laughs> oh, I hate this place so water, much. Because of those things? Look at them. Look at those dudes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just hanging. And plus, like, there's also dogs up here. Oh, yes. it's a mess. It's a mess. This is the worst place. And uh, oh, you can tell which ones are not. And yeah, because they're colored. It's like it's like watching an old cartoon. Oh yeah, it's like know? oh, I wonder what book he's gonna pick up, and it's yeah, like a and it's brightly like, colored one. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why that was always the case. Like, I always wondered that it's too. Weird, because uh, like it shouldn't be that show. hard to blend it all in. Oh, he died instantly. <laughs> <laughs> in my opinion, I don't. I don't think. Whoa, I'm this is good weapon. So can you do only a straight bow run? I might already ask this, but can you? Uh, technically, <clears throat> uh, <laughs> I don't think you can, because um, you don't like like because arrows are kind of a limited, limited in early game. That's what I thought. There's no one that sells it. Uh, yeah, there are. You can. You have to buy um. You have to get like um. What are called ashes or mm -hmm. something or like um, umbral ashes that's what they're called and like they allow the shrine maiden who's the lady that sells things to sell new items mm. so are the bows really worth it then i don't think so personally okay. unless you want to like mess with people online why does it have a stab <laughs> it's pretty impossible so. what why does it have a stabbing animation? they should do like a blunt animation where you hit the bottom of their legs and they like get down on their knees and then you bash them over the head you know i really don't know because they just use the same animation. Since it is a blunt weapon. Yeah. Because look, watch. When you do it, it does the exact same animation as you would stab them. <laughs> Actually, when you stab them... Here, let me show you. Actually. Um, it looks like this. Oh. And it even does that with the... Um, uh, it even does that with the two-handed thing. I or the more. Okay. I don't know. It looks like you're stabbing it into the back where it gets stuck. In my opinion. You know, it doesn't. It shouldn't actually work, considering this is a blunt weapon. Yeah. Hey, that thing dropped something. No, it didn't. Or I'm that saying you should go behind the legs and hit them on the legs. I yeah. don't know. I don't well, know. Well, tell the developers. I will. That we need to fix should... Dark Souls Three. Dark Souls Three, <laughs> a game that's been out for like what six years now? Yeah. Yeah. You guys need to fix your game. <laughs> I'm not, yeah, gonna, I'm, I'm not a game designer or anything, but your game kind of sucks. Oh, what does that one do? 
Okay, so what it does, uh, I'm not going to use it, but oh. if you lower your equip load, so if you get naked, which n I, nobody wants me to do, uh -huh. right, because my character is disgusting. I mean... If you get naked, um, you increase your attack power. Oh, okay, I got you. And there's this. Whoa, is that a maid outfit? No. <laughs> you, you can get excited for that, Carlo. <laughs> I mean, oh, what does that ring do? <laughs> oh, it, oh, it, um, it allows you to, your um, stamina to regenerate faster. Oh, that's dope. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm not gonna. One learn. of my favorite rings. Um, show the maid outfit. Okay, it's not a maid outfit, but sure. Hey, hey this hey, scholar look. over here. <laughs> <laughs> Still. I mean, it looks in. cool. It's cool. Okay, <laughs> we just made it to Road of Sacrifices. Hey, I... don't you think it's appropriate that Mr. Cheeto is carrying a Cheeto as a weapon? <laughs> 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 it fits him perfectly. It fits him well. Well, yeah. you think he's beating him with his children. Anyways, this anyway, is a different topic. What? Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, I well, hope you enjoyed it. Hope See you guys later. enjoyed the episode. Subscribe, like, comment, and do all that fun shit. Anyways, goodbye.